Welcome to the chemistry department at Wayne State University, which was recently ranked as one of the top 100 chemistry departments in the world. My name is Jim Rigby and I'm currently the chair of the chemistry department at Wayne State and I'd like to take a few minutes to show you around some of our beautiful facilities. Recently, the chemistry department underwent a $76 million renovation and expansion program. And thanks to the generous support of a former faculty member, Paul Scott, and his wife, Carol, we now have a beautiful 150-seat lecture hall, which supports all of our lecture programs, as well as other activities in the department, and a very large glass-enclosed atrium, which also supports additional programs in our department. The chemistry department is currently home to 27 tenure and tenure track faculty members whose research activities span the gamut of all contemporary research uh, in chemistry. They uh, work closely with 160 graduate students as well as 25 postdoctorals. We also have the newly renovated Lumigen Instrument Center which houses many of our large multi-user instruments. For example, we have a second to none NMR facility which houses three 400 megahertz NMRs, a 500, a 600, and a 700. And most of these instruments are available to our students and postdoctorals for hands-on activities. In addition to our NMR facilities, we also have a first class mass spec facility. It currently houses five mass spectrometers which are all capable of performing all of the contemporary experiments in modern mass spectrometry. In addition, they also service our synthetic activities by providing low resolution and high resolution mass spec data. We also have a very interesting electron microscopy center. Currently, we have two SEMs and a TEM in this center, and these instruments are used to support the materials research activities in our department as well as other departments at Wayne State University. Moving on to our um, x-ray facility, we have currently two single crystal x-ray diffractometers as well as a powder diffractometer. And these instruments provide great support for our uh, chemists by providing structural information that is often difficult to obtain in other ways. We also have a number of smaller instruments in this facility, including IRs, EPRs, and other assorted support uh, instruments for our research activities. In addition to the Lumigen Instrument Center, we also have uh, large instruments scattered among the various research groups in our department. Included among these is the RNA Center, which provides instrumentation support for our extensive nucleic acid research program. I hope you've enjoyed our tour of the chemistry department, and I invite you, if you have further interest in exploring our programs, to contact any member of our faculty or staff, and I'm sure they would be very happy to help you. Thank you.